Now we're just going to show you some conditioning drills you can use besides wrestling and wrestling, uh, actual wrestling drills, just some other extra things you can do near the end of practice just for that extra conditioning. We're going to start with what we call a circle drill and we're going to have our two wrestlers here and the rules of the circle drill is one hand outside of the circle, one hand on the inside. All right. And then what their job is, is to go around a circle as fast as they can, all right, and we're going to count the number of revolutions that they have. And you do that by coming around, we use like the red and the green, you use one of those, and every time you come around, the lead guy might count off a number. So we'll try this. Ready? Go. And we usually have the lead guy count it off out, so count it off out loud. You go around for 10 seconds, switch. Come back, switch, that counts. That counts as a number when you go past it. Switch. Okay, that's good guys, thanks. Uh, so you get the idea, we usually do them for one minute segments. Uh, every 10 seconds they're switching off. And, uh, we keep track of how many, and maybe we'll have uh, a number of circles going, maybe like four or five to a circle, and then how many they get determines on whether they get some extra work and, and that type of thing. So it's, it's kind of an incentive for them, okay? Then another drill that we do is, is a circle eight drill, and we use all the circles. And what we're gonna do with this one is they have to go around the outside, and then they come back to the outside of this circle all the way down, and when they get to the end, we want them to touch the wall, and then we want them to jog back up. So it's a continuous movement. They're never standing in one place. They're always moving, okay? Here we go, go. So you can see they're coming around a circle. They gotta stay down on all fours. Stay down on all fours, touch the back wall, and then they're jogging back. Jogging back to place. Uh, they'll work their way up in the line. There'll be a line at the end here which just gives them a little extra breather, and then they work their way up, they go again. And uh, the only time they're not moving is when they're standing in line, which is for a short time. We call this our, our, our figure eight uh, circle drill. Okay, thanks guys. An additional uh, conditioning drill would be what we call the log roll. Some people call them monkey rolls. Uh, you know, you can have whatever name you want for it. But uh, what it is, is just, uh, we've got three people. They're laying on a mat. The middle man is gonna start turning. They're gonna actually roll, okay? And then you're gonna jump over the top of them. He gets your roll, and then the guy on the outside comes. And then you're looking for this middle person. Oh, he's rolling. We're rolling back and forth. And it can get faster and faster and faster. And uh, these are particularly good things, guys particularly good near the end of practice when they're tired anyway, and you hit the log rolls. Another conditioning drill would be what we call, uh, they're actually like ISO push-ups. Our kids call them Iowa push-ups. I don't know where that came from, but uh, usually we'll be around a big circle. This is a small circle just for demonstration purposes, but usually it's the big circle of the mat, and we'll have the whole team spread around, or we'll have maybe half the team on one and half the team on another circle. And anyway, their hands are on the outside of the circle, they're gonna start out in, in this position, and then you're gonna start with one guy, he's gonna do one push-up, and then come up and hold it. Then the next guy do one, the next guy, the next guy, the next guy, right here. Then it comes around to this, the starting guy, and he'll do two, and he calls them out, two. One, two, and then one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Then we start again. Three. One, two, three. Hold the position, and we go all around, three of them, three of them. One, two, three. And then to four. One, two, three, four. And then so on, and so on, and so on, and come One, to Justin. Two, then we'll, we'll hit a peak, we'll give them a number to work up to, it might be five, and five is a lot, particularly if you got maybe 30 guys around a circle, that gets to be a lot, you're holding it up there for quite a while. And then it'll, it'll come back down, we go from five down to four. One. Two, three, four. And then four here, four here, four here. One, Comes to Justin. Three, four. And, and that really helps build up the upper body, chest, arms, 
And, and just the fact to tolerate pain, it's, it's a good one. It's, it's a mental toughener. 